Good morning. First of all, we'd like to apologise. There wasn't a vlog yesterday. We had a really bad day again yesterday. I know a bad day like that in the ages. I don't know what caused it, to be honest with you. But of course, it started off a chain of events. Once he had one meltdown, then he had another one, another one, another one. I think it carried on right till he went to bed last night. Um, it's of course, we didn't vlog because it just wasn't fair on his vlog when he was like that and we just didn't feel like picking up the camera because it was too distressing to see him like constantly banging his ears, scream and shout. It was weird because he was fine in the morning and then as soon as we went in the car is when he started. So I don't know um, if he's scared to go out in the car, getting scared to go out. It's weird because it's only been happening since the transport using the harness on there. We do, obviously we don't use the harness for him in the car because normally he's fine. Um, so I don't know if it's that sort of thing. I think we'll just have to keep an eye on him and see how he actually goes. But anyway, like I said, good morning. Welcome to a very stormy, windy Sunday. As you can see out behind me, we've got Storm Kira above our visit. I'll fish the fish the amber warning for the whole of the country. And uh, believe me, it is really windy. Last night we heard it, it woke the kids up, of course, and with Ben. When he goes to sleep, he wakes back up again and takes him ages. So I think it was about half past four. Was it? We flew off to sleep this morning, so he's only just woke up, but you just had your breakfast. So you need to get your medication for that in a minute. So anyway, yep, so um boys football's been cancelled, so we could have a lazy Sunday, aren't we, my darling? Yeah? If she sees what my hand on the gate, what's coming as we open the gate for him. Does matter. He tired still. The horrible wind last night woke you up, didn't it? Um but anyway, yep, so um <laughs> I guess you'll be on once and I'll um, see you in a bit. Yeah, so Sam has just found this live stream, isn't he, sweetheart? It's got a storm car, obviously storm car from London Heathrow, watching these planes um, land. And believe it or not, they're actually struggling to land. They're actually shaking, some of them are. And apparently these guys on here said the actual storm is actually 17,000 miles wide. So it's actually a huge, big, massive storm. Obviously you can see some of the ground and stuff like that, but surely if they can't land, surely will they divert them somewhere else? But it's quite interesting to actually see how these pilots handle it. But yeah, it's all called Big Jet TV. Who Sammy is watching? I don't know how he managed to find it. I do not know. But must be Sammy likes all the planes and things like that, doesn't he? So yeah, it looks bad there, doesn't it? Well, I haven't checked outside. I'm gonna check outside in a minute. See what house is like. Look at that. It's crazy. So yeah, as you can see, it just popped up on the computer about a tornado warning in Storm Batters UK. It's up to 90 mile now again, north winds, I know the coast is really bad at the minute. I know there's some local flooding as well, so we're stopping in the warm up with feet up now. Yeah. There you go. This one coming into land now, then Sammy. There you go. Look at this one then, Sammy. It's just about to grace our screens, folks. There you go, Sammy. Here one comes. Watch this. The thing was, tell you what, I know Sam wants to go on the plane, but I want to go on the plane like this with you, for the turbulence. I bet they've got a bumpy ride, and I bet they've had a bumpy, um, they'll have a bumpy landing as well. Go on the seat out. Watch this one land. Sammy said he wants to um, go to his throne now and watch him to play, take off and land. <laughs> I didn't realise it's such a place, you know. Where's Heathrow? Yeah, we're M25. If we go past it, we go down Chessington, don't we? So he's, he's, he's been sat on this, he's been on this channel all day now watching this land. All I say, good, 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 gives good quote to his pilots and stuff like that, wouldn't you? I wouldn't want to land a plane in this weather, no way. You can see, look, the plane, the wind's taking the plane. It's scary. Look at that. Yeah. This boy's all over the shop. Bloody hell. Who would have thought the wind could do anything like that? Would you have been playing like that? It's crazy. Look at... Bloody hell. Look at that, Sammy. Wow. But they could have a bumpy landing in a minute, Sammy. Ready? Oh, a bit of a bumpy landing. <laughs> yes, yeah, so as you can see, Stephen's up. Um, obviously, he went back to bed, didn't you, when I got up? Did that sleep do you good? Oh, I'll tell you, it's giving me a headache. What, going back to bed? I'll tell you, I hate being away during the night. 
not, you're, not, you're not used to having weather like this. We're not, are we? Storms. I think that's what we... I've never had wind before, but not this bad. It's I know. This bad for a long time. It hasn't. I think this is what woke Ben up, because obviously Ben went to sleep last night, and then we heard him... Um, when you woke him up at half eleven, didn't it? Yeah. And you did go back to sleep till about half past four, I, I believe. I reckon it could be another bad storm Wednesday night and Thursday. Oh, great. Mm. So, if you see there, Stephen's just put the chicken in. Um, we're have a nice roast dinner. Thing is, it must be bad because I've never known all these places to close before, have you? No, it's the first time I've ever known that. Maybe, it's just, maybe they should do that on a Sunday in theory anyway. Yeah, that's exactly. It's like I um, was listening to. Michelle, obviously in heart, was it heartbreak on um, Radio Oxford this morning, and she was saying it's like nature's way of saying that. Um, take a day off. Yeah, take a day off. Yeah. Have a family day. So anyway, we what we're going to do is probably die down a bit first and check outside if you've got any damage and stuff like that. I can't see any slates off the roof or nothing like that. So can you? No. But tell me one thing we do do, am please. So yes, as you can probably hear and see, it's still windy out here, just like next door. Their bins are just behind the bins, just there around their bins. Okay. okay, look at that, look at that. It's windy. Really, really windy. I can see why those planes was um, struggling to land when the family was watching. That's scary, the fact that Mother Nature could do something like that. Like that. Anyway, I'll quickly show you what I done to, we done to Ben's trampoline yesterday. Yeah, we what she done was my old rotary line. We actually got some of the leaves, or well, those are the strip things, and actually tied it to the grate. So hopefully that should have went. Otherwise, should have went. And then one thing we finally done was got rid of Sammy's gold net and also the sand bit because that'd be gone straight away. So anyway, quick, please, we can't see those slates or nothing off the roof. Fall off the roof, which is great. So I can go back in the wall because it's starting to rain again. Right then, as the storm rages on outside, uh, we're having our Sunday dinner. There's the veg, we've got some cabbage and carrots. <coughs> There's the gravel, the gravy. I think I've done too much gravy to be honest with you. There's Mr. Chicken, all carved up. And potatoes this time, I could be asked to peel anything, so these have come out of a bag. I think we don't have the water, do we? Right, and some. Yorkshire puddings because we didn't buy any stuffing yesterday because this person here decided to have a major meltdown yesterday going shopping so as of this week we're going to be going just me and Cheryl don't we Cheryl or, or, or we're going to order it in yeah look at it look at Storm Cara tell you what she's like an a... evil beast she is isn't she evil she is. Tell you what, Sam is still watching that live stream, isn't he, on those pilots? And yeah. Tell you what. Shell's still got it on here. I have actually. Sam's watching it on in there. The old system's warning pilot, which is, so therefore, he just doesn't even think about it. He just throws it out. I don't know if this one's coming into land. This is, uh, what channel is this? It's called Big Jet TV. Sammy found it earlier on, and of course it's got me hooked watching it now. Let's watch how this one lands in the storm. You see how sideways the plane is on coming in. It's scary. Things, what do you stand by their landing for? Yeah. Right. Oh, it's like a big one. Is he going to land? Is he going to land? Is he going to land? Ooh, a bit of a bumpy land. Wow. Yeah. Sideways on, hey? Eh? God, that must be a shunt when you land on that. Cool. Anyway, from what it's like at Heathrow at the moment to what it's like here. Now, as you can see, the rain is starting to come down now. Yeah, it's not been a great old day, has it, today? <laughs> Because I've never known a lot of places to close like they have done, you know. I've never known that to happen before. Yeah, back to the yum yum dinner, and uh, yeah. I remember that prior to the new Sunday trading laws that came in. I remember I know I was only what just over quite young when it happened, and Sundays used to be the day of rest, didn't it? It used to be God's day. Technically, not being arty. 
this is technically classed as a category one hurricane, but they won't class a hurricane because you haven't got an eye in it. But you think you've got hurricanes that win, so it doesn't make sense. Cheryl, you don't want to have a hurricane, believe me. I know what they're all trying to say is this is hurricane from Queens. Yeah, I know, but they won't call it a hurricane, hurricane. because it's not a hurricane, it's yeah. a storm. It's a storm. Because of the jet stream being crazy. 250 mile an hour jet stream they reckon we've got above our heads at the moment. So if you're in a plane coming from America to the UK, you're going to be, be in a plane. You're going to be flying over. <laughs> what they say? Um, the plane last night from JFK to Heathrow, so it takes six, six hours, doesn't it? It done it in four hours and something, so yeah. two hours off the time. Yeah. Hey, my dinner's ready now. Dinner. Right, yum yum time. Yes, you can see over there. The sun is coming out now. I think we're over the worst of here. Right? So it's a bit windy. Um, but I think less than the majority it's actually passed through now. I'm just feeling so I'm really quite pleased that there not isn't much damage to the garden at all. Especially it's great. Obviously it's done damaged bench trampoline a little bit more, but that was damaged anyway. Um, I think it has the help because I've got a pole there, but um yeah, so I think we we should get quite lucky, but we knew it was coming, so like I said we did prepare. We took most of the things we could have lifted off anyway, so yeah, it's a nice blue sky. So Prepare for the next storm. I can see the records in the next storm coming back Wednesday or Thursday. He was reading on the internet. So, anyway, it's a little bit chilly, so I thought it'd update that most of it's gone now, so which is really good. See, so, yeah, so that brings a sweat and stormy Sunday to a close, and I can't believe how strong that wind was today. It's unbelievable. I've seen some of the footage on um, YouTube and also on the internet, stuff like that. I've um, watched one video clip where I actually blew someone's house. Decided the house down somewhere in Scotland, and that must have been crazy. It's somewhere in Lincolnshire, a windmill had its entire windmill come off. I know. The thing is, that when we it's crazy how that was. The picture was. Oh. It is. The thing is, though, when we go down to Butlin, Skegness, that's when we drive past, isn't it? Because so we yeah. say, "Look at that windmill! Look at that windmill!" and stuff like that. So well, I hope we hope it's all good in Skegness and uh, all on all the coastal areas at the moment. Exactly. Because on there, well, what was that clip I was watching? Now that big ten meter high wave. I can't remember where it was actually. So anyway, you can see Mr. Ben here, bless him, there he is in his bedroom, bless him, he's actually watching in that garden. He still loves that program, bless him, doesn't he? Yeah, so. I do apologise for yesterday, but he, it was just a, one of those days where, you know, Ben had a real bad day and it wasn't worth the vlog because, you know, it, just it wasn't, wasn't worth it, so. doing. No, it doesn't worth doing it. But as I said, um, <clears throat> don't know what it is, um, possibly, do for likes Aldi. The thing is, again, we do the same thing over and over and over again. So obviously Ben doesn't like change. So he knew where he was going. He just wasn't happy for yesterday for some reason, was he? So he <laughs> probably is actually. But obviously, like I so said, we're not going shopping this weekend because obviously Saturday is my dad's birthday. So we'll go down to dad on Saturday, don't we? Yeah. And then Sunday, fingers crossed somewhere, depending obviously, we head off to work cast you know, our mailing pass. So that should be good for the end of the year, shouldn't it? So. Anyway, guys, yeah, just want to say thanks for watching today. Um, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you're not already. And hopefully, we'll see you tomorrow. Yeah. Fingers crossed. See you across. Bye bye. See you guys. Where are you going?